Good day there royal fans, I'm your host Sheldon Moon and today's royal headline. Queen snapped by Prince Harry on heartbreaking day for Her Majesty. On Friday it was revealed Prince Harry would not travel back to the UK from his new Californian home for a planned service in honour of his late grandfather, the Duke of Edinburgh. Prince Philip's service of Thanksgiving will take place on March 29th at Westminster Abbey. Many members of the royal family will likely be in attendance. Prince Harry's biographer, Angela Levin, claimed the Duke of Sussex's choice was a snub to Her Majesty, as the first anniversary of her husband's death approaches. Prince Philip died on April 9, 2021, aged 99. Ms. Levin described how the Queen was still grieving the loss of her husband of 73 years. She told the son, He has snubbed the Duke of Edinburgh, but really he is snubbing the Queen. He has got this all wrong. If he comes over for a royal event, he gets police protection. What they won't do is, if he goes out with his friends, he gets security. He'll probably use the same excuse to try to get out of the Platinum Jubilee celebrations. The news comes amid a furious security row between Prince Harry and the Home Office over his and his family's protection, should they make the trip from the US back to London. The Duke became embroiled in a High Court case battle after being told he would not receive the same degree of security when returning from the US. Prince Harry had offered to pay for the personal security detail himself. The Duke has said he wants to bring his wife, Meghan, Duchess of Sussex, and two children across when he makes the journey from California to London. But Prince Harry insisted he does not feel safe to do so without the police protection he seeks. The Queen and Harry's father, Prince Charles, have not yet met the younger Sussex child, Lilibet Diana. The Duke's legal team is arguing the Sussex's protection in the US cannot have the same level of effectiveness abroad and do not have access to UK intelligence networks. Introducing the case for its first hearing last month, Shahid Fatima QC argued on behalf of Prince Harry that the Duke was desperate to return to visit family and friends. Interesting. Alright guys, that's our news for today. Thank you so much for watching and all your support. Please like, comment and subscribe for more. Goodbye for now.